Hello. Welcome back to Bloodborne. I just realized there's actually a side area I should do now. Because, uh, I just got the key for it a while ago. Why don't I go do that? I mean, what the heck am I doing over here? Anyway, uh, man, I'm doing this in the evening. It's getting, it's gonna get uploaded after my Metal Gear thing. Man. Major got all out of whack because I was too tired to bother. But anyway, it's here. We're doing Bloodborne. I'm gonna finish it. I wanna finish it. But, uh, I'm not sure. I'm just gonna do one part or two today. I might just do the one for the sake of convenience. Can you for me? Because. I I haven't played a lot lately, but I've still kind of ended up worn out from the game. Just I, I don't I don't feel like playing it as much or whatever. I mean, I still want to I still want to get the last trophy besides the ending one, which involves going into the fantastic chalices, which currently being blocked by the. The dog in the fourth chalice. Likely because my HP was sliced in half, but that's that's just an excuse, really. Let's repair this. But yeah, uh, so I'm just gonna probably do no, not here. Do the one part. Probably only do one tomorrow. Uh, it's not hard doing this. It's just that I don't know. Feeling slightly less motivated lately. Probably because I'm doing longer sections for Metal Gear. It's surprisingly tiring. I mean, my voice is fine. I haven't, I haven't like wrecked it from talking a lot because usually I barely talk at all. But doing these, I do at least 40 minutes. Or in the past, I did like three parts that totaled up to about 40 minutes. But now, now that I start doing Metal Gear stuff, I'm just doing huge, lengthy. Lengthy things because, you know, the missions are lengthy and whatnot, and I want to get them done and stuff. Uh, it wasn't really necessary, but I just didn't feel that doing that 15 minute thing would have been nice because the saving in Ground Zeroes is really wacky, and I don't know if the side missions had them, I'm not 100% sure, but it's, it's possible for. for. 444, Fan of Pain. I'm gonna start doing it in uh, shorter parts. So, be slightly less irritating. Because, I don't know, having two parts that are shorter, I don't know, I just feel they're slightly more, you know, easier to approach. Because, you know, they're not really long, they're not as. Oh crap. And they're, they're faster to upload them, so rather than just having a huge part that takes forever to actually fully upload, or two parts that it'll, it'll be done halfway, the one part will be, and you know, that's just probably nicer. Not that anyone's actually been watching my last few things. It was nice that, uh, that uh, someone had. He's pretty nice. Enjoy that guy's content. It was nice that he. Oh crap! Came over here, but you know, people have their own schedules and stuff. I t fucking <sighs> what a mess. Not even gonna talk about that, but just you know, stuff, stuffy stuff, stuff and stuff. Just move away from that. Actually, you know what? I'm feeling it. I'll do two parts. Why not, right? Gotta keep consistent. Except for that one time I did one because the internet was awful. And that one time I did four, maybe five. And that other time I did three. <laughs> uh, zero consistency, guys. There's, there's no. My. That's what happens when you hold the controller with only one hand. It was my right hand, too. So. Yep. Gotta move with the left stick. And I use my right hand to do that. Not the best plan. Not the best thing I've ever done. This is uh, gonna bring me back a couple seconds. 
Uh, I guess the problem is I always try and kill everything and I guess I really don't need to. I could just ignore some of these guys. In fact, you know what? Forget it. I will do that. It might, it might get me killed, but I didn't have that many echoes, did I? Uh, I had a few. Not a whole lot, but a few. We run away! Okay, so keep an eye on my stamina bar so I don't overdrain. But I have plenty of stamina, so should be okay. <laughs> Plus I can recover up here. And this one, is there a block here? I think I can go all the way around. Directly to the ladder. Which is where I fell off and died. But... Oh crap, what the heck? Holy crap. Scared the bejeeber out of me. Why, why do you have my echoes? Jump. Well, it's a good thing he almost always drops blood. Ah, uh, never mind. These shiny coins will come in handy when I'm buying, uh, buying... What am I buying again? <laughs> I don't know. I couldn't come up with anything clever for that, but... What would you buy? Some booze after all this? Probably. Probably. And I don't even drink. There we go. All clear, don't need bullets. Let's go through the door! All these incense jars that are empty once you roll into them. Like, what the heck was allowing them to burn? Someone explain this to me! There's nothing in there. Open door with a blah 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 Cathedral Ward key. Bah. Damn these things, I hate them. They're so weird. But they take a surprising amount of damage before they die. Normally. Normally. That guy died in two hits, so... Yeah, everything's pretty OP up here compared to the other area. I'm not exactly sure what level you would be at this point, but I always feel that for a lot of these normal guys, I'm a little underleveled, especially especially annoying with the, the octopus squiddy guys. Those guys kind of aren't a good time because they all know magic and there's like five of them. I think there actually is five of them. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, okay, there is. There's five of them, and one of them you need a key, keel to get a key to progress. Game design, right, guys? Best thing ever. Honestly, I find it quite irritating. It's my opinion, because I hate those enemies. Just a wee little bit. <laughs> but, uh, I suppose I should be able to kill them, okay? I don't know. I hope, anyway. My hopes and dreams! Oh man, I've been frenzied. Oh man, I'm gonna die. This is where it ends, everyone. Everything. Every... Every... Anyone. All that for a sigil that I don't need. Don't have. Can't have. <coughs> and that's what it is. I think. I'm making assumptions, because, uh... I can't tell. Can't pick up another copy of the same sigil. You get the... Madman instead. I don't need more madmen. I'm already insane. That's what I'd say. That is what I did say. <sighs> what kind of blood is this even supposed to be? Gray? Blue? It's hard to tell. I mean, let me just check my clothing, my face. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like mud. I got mud all over my face. It's mud blood! <laughs> oh. A plot reference, I guess. Unintentional. I it just rhymed. I can see why that Malfoy kid uses it all the time. It's so fun to say. Bloody blood. Bloody mud. Ah, 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 ah. Okay, uh, there's nothing over here. I already grabbed what I wanted. Any whom? I'm sure these. Fascinating bullet items will come in handy against Squidwards. I call them Squidward. Why not? They're, they're squiddy, octopusy, I don't know. Something. Okay, this guy here. This guy here is an idiot. What an idiot. Yeah, yeah. Okay, um. I don't know if it's possible to backstab this guy, but I have a new technique, so let's do it. Oh, yeah. That lunge forward makes this the best weapon for backstabbing, in my opinion. 
Eh, I want these items. I don't want the Quicksilver. I don't need the Quicksilver. Okay, so here's the point where I'm going to cheese stuff. And look at that lighting. It's pretty bad. See, see, you can see those guys up there. Let's see if we can hit him. Eh, yeah, can I hit him with a pebble? Why can't I hit those guys? But yeah, they, they break that down and blah blah blah. There's three of them. You gotta run from. See, there's one here too. Run away! These guys hit pretty hard normally. I don't know if they're gonna hit that hard now, but if I can cheese them, why not? Cheese is good. I can't hit him. What are you doing, man? I can't hit you nicely over there. <laughs> That's actually a complete lie, because I can hit you just fine. Oh, man. But the problem is, you're still exchanging blows regardless. It's just that you can get the safety easier. Like so. Did he just fall through the mat? You okay, know, he didn't. The health bar did, though. That's weird. Bizarre. Bazaar. Busy bazaar. Okay, so, as you can see, they're hanging out up there. We run down, and knock it down. There's actually four of them. One of them has a tendency to hide, or not aggro, or something, I don't know. But, having to fight them all at once is kind of terrifying. So, I use the ultimate strategy of cowardice. It works like a charm. Works like a charm. Oh, man. If it works like a charm, I mean, it's it's not actually working at all, but... Okay, let's lock off, please. <laughs> Come on. Whirlwind technique, go! Jeez. This isn't working as well as I would have hoped. <laughs> but, it is working. A wee bit. Why is this one here? Where's the one that has... Did I just kill him? Okay. Hold still for one second. The best thing about these guys is they have literally no stun resist and they have no breakouts, so they can't break out of your stun. Did he literally die while he was beating the shit out of me? What an asshole. Oh, holy crap, I got a bloodstone chunk from that guy. That's incredibly rare, and I don't think I've ever seen it before. From those guys, anyway. I've only gotten like two from enemy drops before, so <laughs> you can't blame me for being incredibly amazed. Anyway, I'll just wait for this guy. Usually I backstab him. You know, fight him like a man. Stab him in the back. Rip out his entrails. Let's set that up, shall we? Squiddy. He's a squiddy. He's, he's, he's not human. I don't follow human rules while dealing with non-human enemies. Charge the enemy! Oh, okay. Well, it still worked. We got him. And? Oh, right. Bold Hunter Mask. That's that's where you get the, the eye charm that lets you get the, the rosemary and, and buy beast blood pellets, and so on and so forth. It's it's okay. And by beast pellets, I mean it lets you buy beast pellets from the inside shop. Which is a side note concerning that the church banned them because of the unknown source or whatever. Kinda seems a little bit on the hypocritical side, but then again, this is the, the game's church we're talking about. And uh, whether that's actually the case all the time or not, there's actually quite a bit of hypocrisy when it comes to religion. You know how it is. Anyway. This looks like a good part to end it. My, my last song isn't done, but it might as well be. So, goodbye!